Howdy, uh, we're going to be doing an upper body and core workout. Um, there is a little bit of roll works going on outside, uh, so if you hear drilling, digging, all that, that's what that is. Um, hopefully, you'll hear me over that. Um, if you haven't done a warm up, head over to the two links that are there for the warm ups, pick either one, doesn't really matter. Um, and then we're going to get stuck into it. So, we're going to start now. So, the first two exercises, well, we'll go through the first one. Is push-ups so we're going to be coming down what we want is not leaving the bum up in the air is the main thing uh, I'll show you a different couple of variations that you can do and then you can pick it which one that suits you so we're going to go for 10 reps so if you have your mat out down we come press up so what we don't want is coming down like that and uh, we can go to the knees that's no problem down we come press up down, back up we go. Uh, if that's still a bit of a challenge, what you can do is get your couch, your half table, whichever you have, and you're just going to, from the knees, lower your chest into the couch, come back up. Down we come, come back up. Second exercise then is a side plank with a reach. So we're going to come down onto the elbow. We have the Shoulder directly over the elbow. We're going to pop the hips up, and what you're going to do is bring the right hand in, reach out, and back over. We're going to do 10 reps, then we 10 reps on the other side. So if you've got your Fitbit or any smartwatch, you can set your to exercise just to log it. So I'm just going to log it here. Just go to workout. And we're going to start. So we're going to do 10 reps of push ups, 10 reps of side plank on the left with a reach, 10 reps of side plank on the right with a reach. Okay, so let's get into it. As you can hear, the saw, not ideal, but anyway. Okay, so let's go. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Get more now. Okay, so we're going to go into our side plank. We reach. There's no rush into these. Just take your time. Set up properly. So up we come. Pop the hips, and we're going to go one, two. Five, nine, and ten. Excellent. Now we're coming. Okay, we're going to swap over. Now we're coming. Pop the hips up, and we go one. You might find one side easier than the other. Sip of water if you need it, if you don't, perfect, and then we we'll come back into it. So make sure you do take a rest if you want to get the optimal out of it. Okay, so we're going to go back into our press ups again, whichever one you do, no problem. So we're going to start off. to do the weaker side first just get it out of the way a lot easier so you can have the knees slightly bent here if you're struggling with balance have the legs separated pop the hips up and we go one four five that's it Seven. follow that hand nine last one on this side ten Okay, 
Next one then. Back over onto the right side again, split the legs if you need to, or you can have them both. Keep that shoulder over the elbow, pop the hips up, and we reach. Seven. That's it. Eight. Nine. And ten. Ooh. How's that going? Whew. Warm now. So we're going to take a little rest. Grab your sip of water. Or there's some left in this. Good stuff. Okay, we're going to come back into it so. Starting off with the press ups. Again, whichever one is suited to you. So. And, and coming down. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Right. Take a little rest in between. So we're gonna be going into our side plank with a reach. Start off on your left or your weaker side. Whichever you like, and we're going to reach in one, and ten. Good stuff. Switching over onto the right, same thing applies, and we're just going to head into it. So, one, two. Keep them hips popped up. Follow that hand. That's it. Good stuff. Woo! Okay, last round. Happy days. Well, last round of this one. So, we're going back into our press ups. We're going one. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Lovely stuff. Whew. People talking in the streets probably hear them perfectly clearly. So we're gonna come down. Um, if you wanted as well, you could do this on your side. You can go one, two, reaching. On this side, keep following the hand. And ten. Well done. That's the first two exercises done. Whew. I to get water and take my hoodie off. Wash now. Okay, next two are plank up downs with a tricep dip. So, again, uh, we're doing 12 reps of this, so it'll be um, six on each hand, basically, on the plank up downs, and then 12 tricep dips. Four rounds again. So, a plank up downs, you just come onto the forearms, have the legs straight out. Um, up we come for one, one, down, down, two, two, three, three, four, four, halfway there, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten, and down. Okay, we're gonna grab our rest on that one. That in the core. So the next one is tricep dips. 
Coffee table would probably be better off. I think the couch would be too low. Um, for a couch, I would probably keep my legs in closer to make it easier. So you're just getting the grip coming down. When I come all the way down, press back up. Depending on what you have, I don't really feel much off that. So I'm going to do it from the table. Um, my bum is going to touch the ground. I'm going to get more of the tricep. So we're going to go for 12. So I'll have the legs straight off for this one. See how long that lasts. So down we come. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And realize there's two more. Yay! Love this stuff. All right, I'm going home. See you later. <laughs> um, right, get your rest. Grab a sip of water if you need it. Uh, check your heart rate because this thing is beeping. Um, and what we're going to do then is go back into our what are they called? Tank up downs. Sorry. Okay. So same as last time, you double counters. Um, I count the rep on the way up. Don't count coming back down. Come back up. Okay. So again, you can go one one two two if you want, uh, or you can do just a one two go up to twelve. So we're going to go back into it, back onto the forearms. I'm just going to put my t-shirt in a little bit. Okay, so up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. I'm not counting it that way because I'm going to lose count. That's it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! 11, 12, and go. Whew. So much easier making me do the workout. <laughs> right. Uh, see how we get on again. Whichever you prefer. This time, I'll just show you. Keep it in close. That's two, three. Out to feet come. Six. Go a little bit more, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So, as the feet are going out more, the more depth you get, the more tricep you're hitting. And what we want to do is get that. It is very easy to keep the legs in. You're going, yeah, up and down all day long. But you don't get the most out of it. We want to be getting the most out of it. That is two rounds. We have two to go. Didn't think this is going to be the most difficult, but as you can see, my I'm, my breath is running. <laughs> okay. Third, second, and second last round of the plank up downs. Whew. How are you getting on? Make sure you're getting um water in as well. As I'm telling you that, I'm just staring at my bottle, I'm not saying it. Or not drinking it. Whew. Okay. So into position and up we come. Down we come. Yes. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last four. from the knees as well. I'll demonstrate that in the last round just to show you. Ooh. I'm gonna grab my sip of water. No point because I need to do it. No need not doing it. Nice little challenge one this is. Okay so let's go. We're gonna try and keep the feet out. There is a little bend in the knee, don't worry about that, doesn't have to be completely straight. Now we come, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, ten, eleven, twelve. Whoo! And burning now. 
Right, how are we getting on with it? Last one on the D2. So. On my phone. Taking nice deep breaths. Listening to the beautiful console. Bad time to record this in Okay, so last round of our plank up down. So, like I said, uh, if you're feeling this, it's getting a bit more challenging. Um, try and start off in the harder one. So, with the feet, the legs up, like we've been doing all along, then maybe drop it down. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to do six of full and six of the half. Whew. So, we're going to start it off onto the forearms. And up we come. Two, three, four, five, six, and you can continue on so you can keep it this way. So we go one, two, don't really feel much, three, four, five, and last one, six. Mm. So you get a small bit out of it, but not as much. Uh, definitely get more out of the foot. Right. Last round of tricep dips. Hope we're getting on okay. We're just gonna get these ones done, take our break, go into the Friday two exercises. So, let's go. So, down we come. Four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, last two, eleven, last one, and up we go. Good stuff. Alright, grab a sip of water. Okay, prone lift offs. We've done this the last time, and um, we're going to do dead buggers. I'll show you different uh, variations. Just to help you. So the prone lift offs isn't too bad. It's uh, just working the shoulders um, and the upper back. Back. Um, just to get movement into them. As you can see, mine won't be uh, mine won't be the most uh, flexible or mobile. But uh, we're using this time to work on things. So down we come, like nice and flat. Ooh, and out, like no, a little bit anyway. So lift the arms, pull them back, push out. Down we come. And I'm just going to change that because that's going to be my way. Yeah. Uh, again, we're going to be doing 10 of these. So, down the corner, we're going to start off. So, so lifting up, we go up, back down. That's one, two, three, four, five. Halfway there. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. So it's not the biggest of movements, but it's just to get the get them working. We're going to work at some stuff. Uh, dead bugs then. Uh, people find this challenging in the lower back, and if you do that, you can alternate ways, uh, which I'll show you throughout. Um, the main thing here is people kind of struggle to um, work through the core. And that's what we're kind of doing here. Or that's what we're meant to be doing. Uh, so there's different variations. So, it'll be 10 each side. So, to set up, what we're going to do is bring our legs to what they call tabletop. So you're kind of 90 degree, 90 degree. I hope that is 90 degree. We bring the arms up. Um, what we want to do is get the couch out of the way. Two seconds. Oh, hopefully this will go back for her. Let me show up a little bit. Right. So, as I was saying, we're in our position. What we want to do is this. So we're going to come down, back up. Down, back up. We want to be coming through here. Sometimes what happens is this will be going all over the place. People are like, oh, you end up look like you're falling. Uh, what we can do there is starting off, 
same position, just work one at a time. Do maybe an arm, a leg, arm, a leg. So obviously that's going to take longer. Um, then what you can do is reduce your range of motion. So you bring the arm down, you bring the leg. So you only tip the leg. Okay. If you're still struggling with that, just do the legs down, back up, down, back up. If you think you're okay with that, you can come down, back up. My leg is hitting off the fireplace, so my range of motion is reduced straight away, which is not too bad. Um, we're just keeping everything in here. But anyway, we're going to get started. So it's going to be 10 each side. So we're going to be going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Controlling it through here. I think I lost count. Eight, nine, and ten. So see the way that moves just slightly back up. That's what we don't really want to do. Okay, that's round one done. I know that took a little bit longer. It's just a little bit more explanation with the dead bug. If you're really struggling with that, you can go into um, back to the planks. Just a normal plank, or you well, don't really like normal plank. You can do plank up down. You can do. Um, you just do a normal sit up if you want it. Try, try the dead bugs, they're really good. So what we're gonna do now is go sorry, back into our lift offs. So we tend to do So we're going up and back for one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and last one. There you go. Uh, if your range of motion on that is better than mine, well done. My shoulders are not my friend really. <laughs> um, so we're just going to work on that. So you get higher, pull it back, you get better range of motion. Um, as you can see for me, it's coming up, so just in there, but don't worry if you're getting higher than that, that's even better. If you're getting lower than that, uh, just get something to dig in, <laughs> no, I'm missing. Um, just like what I'm doing, just working the range of motion. Right, we're going back into our dead bugs, just going to fix my mat. So, up we come into our position. And let's go. One, I'm back in the bloody in the couch. Two, three. You continue on, you can get full range of motion. Don't mind my hand. Six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Woo! Right. Second last round. Grab your sip of water if you need it. Not bad over workout. Nice little over buddy. Okay. Right, let's go. With the hands up, up, up they go, down, back it. Five, halfway there. The last one, there you go. Isn't too much I can do with that one. Right, what I need to do is fix where I'm lying. We're gonna come back to small bit because the couch is angling just a little bit. Yeah. Second last round, dead bugs. I hope they're going okay for you. 
Right, so again, we start off calf level. Hands up. Off the level. Bloody hell, that couch. Two. Three. Four. I'm going to scooch down. Uh, right about five. Six. I think I got that wrong, but anyway, seven. Eight. Whoop. Nine. Last one. Ten before I knock the place down. Right. I hope that wasn't was king. I'm gonna see if we can get this back a bit further. There you go, who were blocking us. Alright, so we're gonna push back. How are you feeling? Hope you're feeling okay. Uh, last round of this. That brings us to the end of our workout then. Well done. So, let's go. Last round. Doing good. So, and up, as always, up they come, back down. That's one, two, three, four, halfway there, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And hit. Lovely stuff. Right. Into the final round of the dead bugs. Hope they're going okay. If you if you've any questions, don't be afraid to get in touch. Just drop a message. So that I can answer. You can even even if you record yourself um while doing them, if you can, let me know how you're getting on. Um if there's anything we can do to improve them or make them better. For yourself, easier. If you're still struggling with the lower back, uh, do let me know and I'll change it up. Right, hands come up, legs come up, and let's go. There we go, not hitting the couch. Back up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one. 10. Lovely stuff. Well done, that's the upper body, body weight, uh, upper body and core, I should say. That's it. Um, you'll be getting lower body next. Good job.